The first part of the competition is a series of timed qualifying heats. Here's action from the first round of those heats. Tiff Nidell is the commentator. Duran and Gollop, they're neck and neck up to this important first quarter at Paddock. Gollop trying around the outside, it's slippy still, and he's lost it. Round just tapped Duran, but uh, Gollop way out. And now John Welch comes through to second place as Gollop, here we are in car. He's on the outside trying to get, and he just locks up the brakes, tapped Duran, and he's already changing gear to get down to first gear to get going again. But out front, it's Duran now with a little bit of a lead over Welch. And these two keen to get good times in from these qualifying heats to get on the Durham wide, all through the tyres, onto the grass, trying to get on back onto the track for clearways here. He still leads. This is, and Welch, Welch dives up the inside of Leighton. Not Doran's off. No, he's not. He's grappling for it. Four-wheel drive, of course, this Group A escort. And Duran did a superb job there, and a real four-wheel drift as Welch comes back off the grass. Now he's going to come from the back of the grid to fight up. Duran escapes and he's still in the lead. Here we see that manoeuvre of Welch, really a very late charge up the inside. Duran in car here, swirling the wheel, keeps the power on, all four wheels spinning underneath him, and eventually gets the Escort back under control. Welch, though, he's at the back. He's got to get through these midfield pack to get back at the front, but he's out wide, always in the slush and mud and donk. Now he's hit the right side of the car. We're in car now with Gollop from the back of the car. There's Welch parked. Welch gets it back going again right in front. He's not going to be a popular man at the end of today.